The birth of most Mexican drug cartels is traced to former Mexican judicial federal police agent Miguel Angel Felix Gallardo, Spanish, El Padrino, lit. The Godfather, who founded the Guadalajara cartel in 1980 and controlled most of the illegal drug trade in Mexico and the trafficking corridors across the Mexico-U.S. border along with Juan Garcia Abrego throughout the 1980s. He started off by smuggling marijuana and opium into the U.S., and was the first Mexican drug chief to link up with Colombia's cocaine cartels in the 1980s. Through his connections, Felix Gallardo became the person at the forefront of the Medellin cartel, which was run by Pablo Escobar. This was accomplished because Felix Gallardo had already established a marijuana trafficking infrastructure that stood ready to serve the Colombia-based cocaine traffickers.